Chagulani says he got information that there are unknown people who are planning to kidnap his children in order to frustrate him into throwing in a towel of the presidential race due to the 14th January, something Chagulani says won't allow. Era tuafuna information ya webu wa magezi kati ya kwate kubana uyepesa elijio kutugonza. Nesonga luachi tuasa zeu abana tuwamute gule tuwajeo abere ngata ina wainza kutuita kutugonza kukiriza vita kukiriza. Era fabantu wabakulu fetu gendo kulonda. Nolo nesongeyo maimu sebe ni naenja gala jukire njigo yali agendo kufesi ngobote ya jawa abana be. Nivadiringa na chonga abantu wabakuru. Era mkampeni za fe, temba deba na bata netuka. Fena tuli bantu wabakuru, awasuka, emiaka, ekumi no munaana. Era fe tugendo kulonda. He added that it's very unfortunate that the government has nothing to tell Ugandans. The reason there is continued spread of propaganda linking Chagulani for presidency to foreign funding. More to tell or convince the people of Uganda, but resorting to propaganda. We are Ugandans. All Ugandans have seen us and they see how we operate. What we stand for are the causes of the common people. No Ugandans need to be paid to demand for justice. No Ugandan needs to be paid to demand for better roads, better schools, better hospitals. No Ugandan needs to be paid to see the wrongdoings of this regime. Chagulain said that security has tried several times to plot harm against him and failed the reason all his close family members restricted in movement are not enjoying citizen privileges has is the case for other Ugandans. Kisina kutambula na moto kanyinji, sina kutambula na konvoi. Waise u akadewenda chikantono, atene mola ba, ngemoto ka esuka makumi abidi eza patrol police na zizitu goverera. Gazo ziringezi gamba tisi nyingi wabasi konvoi. Echo chongero kula gabana Uganda, tabibi ukwerinda, baina omupango ogutusa ogulabe kubulamu wange. Neenze, ngo mtu, nabagamba, newayo, kule guanga liange, kastensi yona, emanyiche pa planinga okunko lako. Various government dignitaries weighed in on the move describing it's a betrayal of people power subscribers who have sacrificed a lot for Bobby Wayne's cause. The Minister of State Foreign Affairs Okelo Olim said in court the move is a betrayal to the Ugandans who are fighting for him, the likes of his guards and the different supporters. On the same, government spokesperson Ofono Pondo said at least NRM and Museven track record of not harming or assassinating politician is available. Recording history, Kizabe Sijef fled in 2001 with similar claims. His wife claimed he would not be poisoned while in Luzila. Sejusa too fled and made claims. Chagulani resumed his campaign trek for the vote with the Namayunga district. On this way, 15th of his new campaign team members were arrested and instant Chagulani links to the electoral commission failure. operation that is ongoing it shows you the panic and uh, you have seen that Mr. Biabakama and the Electoral Commission has been conspicuously silent about all these grave uh, irregularities that are ongoing. The misbehavior of the security forces, Mr. Biabakama and the Electoral Commission is pretending not to be seeing what is happening. Sarah Nakandi, STV Select News.